Here's how I make coffee stained paper. I take two cups of water, put it in the microwave for three minutes, and I'm doing that because I'm using instant coffee. And I take two tablespoons of instant coffee, put it in this container, and then I'm grabbing the water and I put it in so it dissolves. After that, I'm going to put the paper in. I'm using my cardstock paper pack size and I'm putting it in with the tongs because it's boiling water and I don't wanna burn myself. I put the oven on warm, which is about 175 degrees. And I'm doing that because I'm going to cook the paper in the oven so that it dries faster. Before I put it in the oven, I decided that I wanted to get the spray bottle, fill it with coffee, and yes, spill it everywhere, <laughs> and um, spray it on, but realized I needed to add more coffee because it wasn't dark enough. Then I spray it on the paper. Then I put it in the oven for about 10 minutes. I have to check on it to see if it's done yet, and I used different textured cookie sheets and cooling racks to do this because it adds a visual texture to the cardstock that I really like. The cooling racks add all kinds of lines and checks. And it's interesting how it does it. The same piece will be different on both sides, which I really love. I realized the contrast wasn't dark enough, so I thought I would put some more coffee on and put it in the oven to dry some more. It didn't make really that much of a difference at all, so I don't know what I'm doing wrong with that. And finally, I wanted to see what the white cardstock would look like if I just sprayed coffee on it, not soaking it. And I cooked that in the oven for the same amount of time. And this is what it came out like. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.